an old friend. A very old friend came back. But why? He seems very suspicious when he's with us. He's the imposter! Oh my god. Also, guys, I've got merch now. Go on my YouTube channel and go to the store and you can buy merch. Now, go to the more maps, head over to the neighborhood, and then once you're here, go to the left, and then there's going to be a bush. Hop over the bush, then there's going to be an Edgeworld poster. Click it or tap it, whatever you're on, and you will get the old friend badge. Lost in Nevada. You really lost your mind with all these signs. Oh my gosh, that's a big chef turtle. Anyways, to get this badge, go ahead to the maps room and go to more maps. All right, once you do that, go over to Nevada. We're going to Nevada. All right, so once you're in Nevada, go ahead and turn around this way, okay? Hop over here, and over here at this corner, you're going to want to drop on down and do a little mini obby, okay? A little sign obby, oh. First time, first try. All right, so what we want to do is go ahead and try to jump onto the sign here and then jump across this way. And then obviously, you know, like I said, we're going to be doing this obby. Now, once you're over across this side, go ahead and zoom out. And there is going to be a small sign. Go ahead and click on it right there, as you can see it, and you will get lost in Nevada. Speed run. Congrats. You speed run to find a drawing. Lol. All right, so to get this badge, we're going to go ahead and turn on Minecraft speed running hacks and head over here to the badge room. Once you do that, we want to do is make sure you zoom out and walk kind of slowly. There, they're right there. You see that piece of paper? That is what we want to try to click on. So you can either click it from above or you can click it from below. So if you look up right there, click on it. Oh, there, there we go. Click or tap. And there we go. We sped run Minecraft playing while dancing. Show off your moves of literally finding a badge. All right, so to get this, we want to do is go ahead into maps, go to more maps, and you're going to want to look for the map called the arcade. This is Cappy's um, map. Once you're here behind the speakers is going to be the dancing pad or the DDR. Step on it. And there you go. Show off your moves. Oh, yeah. Clown. What's this clown-ish nose or thing doing here? Unlocks Tricky Face 3. All right. So to get this badge, go ahead into more maps. And once you're there, go into the Nevada map. We're going to Nevada. Somewhere in Nevada. Now, once you're here, head over this way. Excuse me, Tricky Face 3s. Uh, pardon me. Sorry. Go across this rope here. Careful, though. You will get oofed if you fall off. All right. Let's try this again. So I'm going to say maybe just jumping. There we go. That's a lot better. A lot easier. Once you're here, though, go over to this rock. Click on the clownish red nose and click on it and you'll get the badge. Trapped. You're stuck here forever, my friend. There isn't a way out. Unlock a special character known as Witty. All right, to get this, go to maps, and we're then going to more maps. Once you've done that, go to the right alleyway, pretty much in front of you. Once you're there, go ahead and hop over the fence, and go to the vent here to your left, bump into it, it will then teleport you, and you'll get the trapped badge. That's pretty old. What is this skull doing here? Unlocks a special character, tabby all right so to get this badge we want to do is go ahead and slap flutter there we go and then you'll get the badge just kidding no that's just one of my mods from my discord server but what you want to do is go to week four and then once you do that oh you gotta move a little fast okay let's try that again week four and then head over to the back side of this last car there we go go all the way to the end zoom out a bit you're going to see a skull right there. Click it, and you'll get the tabby badge. Fading away. Hey, at least I get to enjoy this view. Unlock the special character, Garcello. All right, so to get this badge, what you want to do is go to maps, and then go to more maps. I know, maps within maps. Once you do that, go the left alleyway, and head down this way. 
and go to your left. It's very left themed. <laughs> now, once you're here, get on the fence, and then do a little mini obby there, and then, or parkour, go up this pipe, then climb up this ladder here, right there. It's kind of hard to see in the dark, but it shouldn't be too difficult. Then head over this way to the edge, and we're gonna drop on down, going into this door, or bumping into it, and there we go. We got fading away. What a great view. It's water expurgation. It's not over yet. Unlocks a special character, Tricky Phase 4. All right, so we want to go ahead and slap flutter again. Just kidding. Don't do that. Um, Head over to the maps. I know I keep saying that, but it's so fun to slap her. Go to more maps and go to Nevada. 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 Now, once you do that, go over here to your left. And there is then going to be, uh, excuse me, uh, move. There's going to be over here two dots, all right? You want to step and run on these. There we go. And then walk straight forward. It will then teleport you. And then there is going to be a wall that you want to walk through. So right over here in this corner, go through this wall. And then walk down this pathway, clicking on the red halo. And you will then get the expurgation badge cookie hashtag e eat hashtags so i guess we're gonna eat hashtags that's fine cookie now to get this badge go to maps go to week two two and head over here to the outside through the window now by this bush there's gonna be a cookie Step on that cookie to get teleported to this little mini obby. We love obbies. Yay. Now over here, you want to avoid the cookies like that. Don't touch the cookies. All right. So now that we've learned that, go over here to the edge like that. Jump. And then again, wait for the cookie. Jump to this little mini platform. And voila. You're not done. Now right here, you're going to want to walk across this edge very carefully. If you have a friend, though, you can get, maybe jump on each other's head. To get over here and then go to the cookie elevator if you do not have that then i suggest carefully and slowly scoot your way across this edge here okay this part is very annoyingly difficult oh i made it all right so just like that it, it, you're gonna probably be doing this a couple of times again here you want to be a little careful just hug the wall like that wait for the cookie elevator to come down. I'm just gonna be patient because I don't want to mess up. Step on the cookie elevator. And then once you do, jump over to this and touch this cookie or go into this cookie. And voila, you have now gotten the cookie badge. Take your time. Don't rush. Just take your time. Smiley face. Unlocks a special character, Sketchy. Alright, so to get this badge, we want to do is go to maps and then to more maps. Whoa, hello. <laughs> Once you're there, go over to this map. This is the sketchy map. And once you do, it'll be teleported. Go over to this corner right here and then slide in through this corner. And ladies and gentlemen, it is an obby. This obby will make you cry a bit. So take your time like the badge says. Take your time. Wait for this and then land on it and then go up. It is pretty buggy. So, you know... Be aware of that. All right. So once you get here, what I suggest is you jump on this as it goes up. And then once you're here, you do have to wait for the right moment. All right. There is a time when it's actually perfect to go across, which is then. See how that, that was the moment. And I missed it. So you got to wait maybe three rotations. So it goes across once. And then it goes across twice. Okay. Okay. And then it goes across three times. And I believe on the fourth, it's when it will be golden. So let's go across. There we go. Boom. Now right here could be a little tricky. So what I suggest is that you go like this and just hug the wall. Take your time on that. Right here, what we want to do is then go to the left and bada beam, bada boom. The pencil means nothing. You lie. The pencil is everything. It's the badge. You have to click on it. And there you go. Dot, dot, dot. Question mark. Unlocks a special cat. All right. So to get this badge, what you want to do is go to the maps room and head to week 
five. Yes, we're going to the mall. We're going shopping, guys. Yahoo! Now, once you do, head over to the right side here through the curtains where you just saw that cartoon cat come from. And behind the counter, there's going to be... I, I don't know what that is. I really don't. I, I, I don't know. Just step on it. You get the badge. Art. Just art. Smiley face. Unlocks a special character. Rip and tear. All right. So to get this badge, what you want to do is go to maps and then to more maps right over there. Then once you do that, go over to the sketchy map, which is the blank one. And you guys might remember there was this obby. Gonna do it again. I know. It's okay, though. It, it's fine. We can do this. I believe in you guys. We can do this again. Just gotta have, <laughs> gotta have confidence. Confidence is key. Move out of my way. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry for you individuals. I'm so sorry. Now, you want to wait for the right moment. I think this is the one. There we go. All right. Then go up onto the tower. Make sure you hug the wall. There we go. Now, do not cross. There's actually going to be an invisible ladder right here going up to the very top of this and then jump onto these little platforms there we go and bada bing bada boom watch out for the pencils coming from uh, above like a beautiful angel coming down to worship the skittles all right there we go and easy peasy lemon squeezy go ahead click on the picture of rip and tear just a dead end you can leave now winky face friendship a friendly rock OMG? No way. Unlocks a special character, Cheeky. Alright, and to get this badge, we want to do is go to more maps right over here. And then once you do that, look over to your left and go to Green Mansion. Step on the teleporter. And once you walk in, go to the right where you see this small little doorway. Step on or bump into it. It will then teleport you into a small place. Head over to this morph right here next to the rat. Just a reminder, the next badge won't be so easy. Uh-oh. Thoughts. He misses one of his old friends, but also mad about something. Unlock a very special character, Cheeky Phase 2. Alright, so to get this, we want to do is go to maps and then to more maps. Once you do that, head over to the arcade map right over here. And now go to this side of the map into this dark area. Bump into the darkness and you'll be teleported to this location. And now what you want to do is go ahead, follow these pages on the ground and touch this glowing orb, which will then teleport you to this map. All you got to do is follow along this way. It's not a maze, so don't worry. It is amazing though. <laughs> and you will see Cheeky over here. What does that say? Just a rock? It's not just a rock. It's a teleporting rock. Now, once you're there, go over to the left side, and you're going to see this right here. Bump into it, and you will get thoughts. Digi, if you're reading this, you're going to be so happy whenever you get to the morph. Your fan, Sobi. <gasps> the first corruption. It all began by a lemon monster, and now it's corrupting others slowly. Unlocks a special reworked skin, boy, corruption number one. All right, so to get this, go ahead to the maps and go to week two, the spooky mine. Once you're in the spooky mine, go over to this side under the stairs. And in the right corner, you're going to see Lemon Monster bump into his head. And it will teleport you to this little mini obby. You want to step on the dark platforms, not on the, um, woo! Okay, you don't want to jump onto the nice, glowing, pretty colors, all right? You want to avoid that. But anyways, go ahead down this way. And if you touch the, um, the color, you won't die. So don't worry. You can literally probably just do what Tank Man did there and just walk through. But go onto this right side and then go over this way. This part, you can't just walk through. You have to actually, you know, jump and avoid falling into the void of glowing Skittle Juice. All right, so here we go. Sir, can you please move? Thank you. All right, keep going. Move, move. Ugh. I hate when people don't move. But this one you can touch because this will give you the badge. Hello, world. Greetings to the void. Unlocks a special character, Hex. 
All right, so to get this, we want to do is go over here to the map room and go to more maps. Once you do that, we're going to go to the basketball court, a.k.a. Hex's map. Once you do that, head over here to the left side, and there is going to be an obby on the other side of this green bushy wall. What you're going to do is climb up this wall and start the obby. Now, it's not easy, but it's not hard either. All you got to do is make sure you just give yourself enough space to jump and plenty of room to walk. Ooh. All right, there we go. Walk around this way. Ooh. Nope. Okay, there we go. Up the green bushes. Eh. Eh. Now, the cloud part can be a little tricky. The reason why there is a spot here, right here, this jump can get you. Ooh. Oh. I should just get really close to that edge. Really get close to the edge of a lot of things. So then you just give yourself plenty of space to jump and land on these um objects Ooh. and there we go easy peasy lemon squeezy bump into hex's head and let's watch some tv madness basement let's just get to the point find it and then it's all yours hashtag a very special character hank to get this one go back to the maps and go to more maps once you do that we're going to be going to nevada Man, if people lived in Nevada right now watching this, they're like, this is fantastic. Now, there's multiple ways of doing this. You can go over here to the left like I'm doing. Go this way. Go over here. Over here. And then go about... Oh, excuse me, sir. And you can go right over here to this side and step on this red platform. It will then teleport you to this location. Go ahead, walk forward, and then take a left turn, and then take a right turn right here. And then immediately turn. Oh, no, no. Keep going forward. And then you turn to your left where there is an invisible ladder. You just got to find. Oh, there we go. Well, or you can just jump on people's head. There are There is a ladder there. But right here is Hank. Go ahead. Bump into him. And there you go. Hank, get the sweet and sour sauce. Now, if you don't have an invisible ladder, Try having a friend just get have them step here and then you can jump on their head or someone in the server Sunshine wake up and get this badge unlocks a special character Bump. All right, so to get this badge We want to do is go to maps and then to more maps like so All right, once you're at more maps go to Bob's week right over here and then you gotta find an invisible ladder my best way of explaining it is go under this la uh, this cloud and the invisible ladder is going to be right here. Step on this ladder, zoom out, and then there's going to be an eyeball there. Click on it and you will then get the sunshine badge. Do not reset though because the next badge is called Onslaught. Ready or not, beware of Bob. Unlocks a really, really special character, Half Glitched Bob. This one is going to be over here on top of the cloud. Step on this white platform, which will then teleport you to another map. Head to the back here and step on this spike. Then go onto this spike. And it's sort of like a mini obby. We have to jump on all these spikes to get to the tippity tippity top. So here we go. Jump onto this ladder. Climb to the very top of the ladder. Going through the ceiling. And then all you have to do is click on this eye behind this area click it and you'll get onslaught kind of sus yo that's kind of sus of you from finding this badge you unlocked a meeting with a special sussy imposter and ejected not really a ejection but you still get kicked out unlocked a special character boy ghost all right ladies and gentlemen it's time to become a sussy baka to get these two badges, we want to do is go to more maps right over here. And then we got to do is go ahead to the Among Us map. Once you do that, we have to do is then go up this way to the top of this mountain. Now, you're not to go into the very top of it, but more like to the back side of it. And once you do, you will then see a vent. Oh, I just saw someone vent. They are the imposter. <laughs> now what you want to do is go ahead and step on that vent which will then teleport you into the vent system and wow 
There, there's a lot of imposters in here. <laughs> what you gotta do though is go ahead and just walk down this way, which would then, at the end of this event, what you gotta do is simply go ahead, walk straight, and it will then teleport you into the, the, the original map. Once you do, turn this way and head to the weapons area. Now, this is going to be the one I'm showing you is going to be the um, kind of sus. Kind of sus will be here on the back side right there. Click on that knife and you'll get kind of sus. Then to get ejected, all you have to do is simply jump over this. And now we've been ejected because clearly we're the imposters. Access. Ron.exe wants to access your files. Do you wish to accept? Unlocks a special file. Flush. I mean, character Ron. Ooh la la. To get this badge, what you want to do is go to maps and then to more maps. We're going to be then going to the right alleyway because that's always the right way. Once you do that, walk forward this way to this fence, whatever you want to call it. We're going to go ahead and hop right over. Head to this vent here, which will then teleport us to a area right here. You will then get the badge trapped as well. Ron.exe wants to access your files. Do you wish to accept? You click accept, and you will then get the access badge. Corrupt speedrunner. His name is Bob. Unlocks Drake. I mean Bob. Smiley face. All right, so to get this badge, it is going to be a little difficult, all right? So you will want to be patient. But go to more maps, and then go to the neighborhood. What could possibly go wrong here in the neighborhood, huh? It's happy, it's sunny. Wrong. Wrong. So many terrible things can happen here. For example, this portal. This is where you want to go. And then this is going to teleport you to this place. Yes. Good God, this is terrifying. But there's a little trick. If you zoom out in third person, you can follow this pathway like so. Look at that. Now, you can try doing this without going into third person. I do suggest, though, you do it like this because it makes it a whole lot easier. Sometimes you're going to have to jump and then not have to be able or not be able to see. Um, if you can do it while doing like this, then great. I do suggest then avoiding that little glowing french fry. And then walking forward and then jump a little. Oh, no. All right. So the, the jump I messed up on is actually kind of embarrassing because this is the whole platform you can jump on. Anyway, so let's continue on, shall we? Uh, Okay, let me forward. There we go. Zoom out. All right. A little jump. There we go. And then let's continue forward. And then we keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. And then it should. There we go. This part can be a little tricky. All right. Ooh. All right. And no, no tricky puns, please. And thank you. Whoa. 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 You can also kind of use the cubes as a reference point on for your jumps. Oh, oh. All right. And then I do want to do like a diagonal jump there. There we go. And then boom. What is his name? His name is Bob. And then go ahead and bump into the onslaught Bob there, and you get corrupt speedrunner. Glass. Insert glass breaking. Oh, unlocks a little man. All right. So to get this badge, we want to do is go into the maps and then go to more maps. Once you do that. Head over to the left alleyway, and then we're going to walk straight forward and take a left turn. Now, it is a, I guess, a mini obby, I would say. And we want to do is just get across without getting knocked off because people are impatient, and it's very annoying. But right over here, there's going to be an invisible ladder. Go up that invisible ladder. I don't know why someone is in Among Us. They're a little sus, oh boy. And we're going to go ahead and do this so we're gonna go across the buildings like so looks like a platform game like from mario and then go across this little thin bridge okay and once you do that head over this way we're gonna go up and you're gonna clearly see a ladder right there we had to jump to that ladder so whoa, there we oh no but it's okay because see 
Ow. <laughs> I was sussed. There we go. You can fall into the water and it's perfectly fine. All right, so go to the very tippity 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 top. Just keep going. Just keep going. And we're going, going, going. And once you do, then we're going to go ahead and drop on down to this building. And right there, you go see some glass. Step on it. Just don't cut your feet. Determination. Nothing in this world stops you from being determined. All right, so to get this badge, we want you is go to maps and then head to more maps. Once you're here, go over to the neighborhood, the happy little neighborhood. And then go over here to the back side of these buildings and you might remember this portal. Now, the great thing about this, we do not have to complete the whole obby, okay? There's a part in this obby that will, um, you, you want to go to. So, first off, you want to zoom out and get onto this pathway. As you can tell, you can't see the pathway from above, so that's why you gotta zoom out and then look from underneath, okay? Take your time, do not rush it. You know, there's nothing, there's no timer, nothing's trying to oof you. Just enjoy your time here. There are some spots that might be a little tricky, but hey, don't worry about this. It, it will hurt you, but it will not oof you completely unless you just stand on it then you know we've got problems <laughs> but here we go keep going and then jump there Ooh. and then head all the way down now what you're gonna see is that red pathway there you can't see it from above so we want to do is line up with it and then jump and there we go simply walk forward into the wall it will then teleport you to this location and then right here underneath the trident is a red heart. Click it and you then get determination. Funny bone. <laughs> you really got nothing better to do besides listening to my puns. Oh, Sans, you silly man. <laughs> or skeleton. <laughs> so to get this, go ahead to maps. Go to more maps. And then you want to go to even more. More mod maps. That's right, you heard me. Once you're here, go to Snowden, which is the map of Undertale. And we're gonna walk down this way. It's a bit of a walk, so you know, enjoy the scenery. Look at the nice big dead trees and all the snow. If you haven't seen snow, there you go. Look at all the snow. So much to see. You can make a snowman, you could make a snow woman, you can make a snow them. You can make a uh, snow angel. Um, you, you can melt the snow and make water. It's very nice. Anyways, let's keep on going. Keep on going. We're gonna keep on walking down this way. Welcome to Snowden. Oh, thank you. What a nice place. It's so happy here. No one's coming out to greet me though. They know I'm looking for a badge. It's okay. Every time I come here, though, it always reminds me of Christmas. I don't know why. It could be the Christmas tree. Could be the Christmas light. Or the snow. Who knows? But you go obviously keep following me. I told you, this is a long walk. But once you're here, go to the back side of these houses. And there's going to be a bone. Bump into that bone. And now you got a funny bone. <laughs> Key number one unlockable key to another step number one so this key is what you're going to need to unlock a certain badge later on but to get this key first go ahead to week five once you're here at week five go over to ofi bops shop go here and step on the counter and you want to move your mouse to right here or tap your phone screen or tablet right there click it and you will get key number one. So the area is actually pretty big. You have a big area to click it. But there you go. You got key number one. Ofi Bop. She's one of those salty girls on Sundays, which they also kind of look like drink. Uh, nothing. Winky face. Unlocks a special character, Ofi Bop. All right. So to get this badge, before you keep going further, you will need the key one badge so this is what you need 
check out my other video on how to get it. But if you already have that badge, go ahead into the map room and go to more maps. Once you do that, go over to the Nevada map and then this part might be a little tricky. So first go ahead and go up this way. I realized the pun I just said, it was unintentional. <laughs> but go over here and right on this edge, you're gonna wanna drop down to this spot right here. So you see that black circle? Go ahead, drop down, spam jump. Might wanna zoom in so then you can get into it. And then you are now in the Nevada basement map. Once you're here, go ahead forward, then go to your left and then go to your right and then keep going forward this way then keep going and then to your right there is a black door walk through that black door and then all you have to do is go forward and what i suggest is get close to the edge here and simply go forward again and there you go so it's actually an l shape so you walk in and then take a left and then there you go you get the badge nonsense whoa powers i didn't know i had one unlocks a special character nonsense all right so to get nonsense go ahead into the map room and then go to more maps once you do that turn around or, or not turn around go to more mod maps and then you're gonna see the nonsense humors fnf house go ahead and bump into that once you're here looking at the stereos go to the left side where the clock is and go right here where you see this poster bump into it and you can kiss it if you want but hey you got the badge spooky man it's a spooky man unlocks a special character skid and pump all right so to get this we want to do is go into the maps and head to week two once you go into week two turn to your left and there's gonna be a dark pumpkin there on the ground step on it and you got spooky month and it's not even october foolhardy you shouldn't be walking around in these areas during midnight but i'll only give you one chance to escape while you still can thank you what a good guy now we have the sprint button isn't that great is at the top of your screen all you have to do is tap it or click it depends what you're on go to more maps and then go to even more mod maps and we're going to the Zardi's maze. Now, just let you guys know, currently the servers might be broken. So what you want to do is maybe go to a VIP server and create your own VIP server. Because for some reason, the hat is not working right now. But if you're following along, what you want to do is now just do this maze. Now, a little trick I've discovered with this maze is if you just stay to the left side of the maze, obviously not going into the dead ends you will get to the badge. So again, don't go to the dead ends. Don't go to the right. Stay just to the left. Or if you're following along, and then, well, it's just easy. You just follow along. It's a piece of cake. Mmm, cake. Actually, pumpkin pie. <gasps> Zardy, I'm gonna turn you into... Wait, Zardy's a scarecrow, not a pumpkin pie. <laughs> Wait, no, he is a pumpkin. Why am I saying? Also, can we just ask the question why this corn is so big? Look at it! It's bigger than my human body! That's pretty epic, I will say. Um, <laughs> but again, keep just following along. It is not very hard. You can actually just zoom out and find your way around. It's not a very difficult maze. There's no hidden passages or anything. But right here at the end is going to be Zardy's hat. And it does move, so it, it, it might be a problem. But for now, you get the badge. Badge Hunter number one. Ah, yes. He doesn't stop hunting down badges, even if it's a difficult one. He'll always find a way to gain the badge. Unlocks a special custom character, Digi! Hey, that's me. Anyways, to get this badge, what you want to do is head over to maps and go to week three, all right? The best place to go where you can get hit by a train. But don't worry, just avoid the train and you're good to go. Now... There is going to be maybe a slight problem. There is supposed to be a ladder here, okay? So, there's the ladder right there on the ground right here. If you can go up it, that's great. However, if there is no ladder, you will then maybe need a friend or someone in the server to stand here 
and then jump on their head and maybe they jump up so then you can you know do that little jumping mechanism so if there's no ladder get on top of this tunnel and have someone help you out if there is a ladder very easy just go to the very top and then there is going to be a little mini obby here so you can see these squares right here these are what you want to jump on and it's not too difficult however you know you can't oof yourself a little bit there anyways you then have to step on the mic and you get the badge monster don't even try touching the lemon you 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 monster unlocks a special character lemon demon monster all right so let's go ahead and get this badge go over here to more maps and once you do go over here to the neighborhood what a great place once you're here in the neighborhood go to the middle red house jump on the speakers get on the roof and the lemon is right there that's where I leave my lemons. 